there guys, my name is Coach Shardogs the Born, but built for theme park news and welcome to the first news update or one of the first news updates of the following day after a load of updates that we uploaded yesterday. Make sure you go check all them out and this is the first of many today. It's Dollywood's turn to get some news and this is on their Harvest Festival event. So we've got some details uh, to share with you about the event and just the, the main bulk of this video is just sharing my thoughts on the event because I've seen pictures from previous years, I've seen videos from previous years, I've seen videos from Dollywood themselves and um, you know I'm very excited to see what direction they're going to go in with this event and I cannot wait, I cannot wait to see what's going to happen with this particular event this year. It will be interesting of course because of the COVID restrictions but the fact that this event is still going ahead and they've started preparing for the Harvest Festival event it is very exciting indeed. So before you get started guys, make sure you like the video if you've loved it, make sure you comment down below your thoughts on this event and of course all the other news that we've been sharing over the last few days. Make sure you comment down below, keep commenting your video suggestions as well as your thoughts and opinions. Uh, all your video suggestions will be saved down, pre-recorded on one day and then all those videos will be edited and processed, ready to be uploaded when there's no news updates. Make sure you also share your merchandise if you want your merchandise featured in a future merch update which will be coming in a few days time hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, once we've got more. Uh, share them in the Instagram, Snapchat or Twitter links in the description down below uh, with your name and your location if you want to. And um, yes, let's talk about Dollywood and let's talk about the first details in terms of the dates and a few little things about this event, this Harvest Festival event at the theme park. So, officially from the website, which again, I've linked in the description down below, dollywood.com forward slash theme park slash festival slash harvest dash festival. That link's in the description down below. And um, yes, basically according to the website, the fresh and comfortable feel, a uh, comforting feel of fall is right around the corner and Dollywood looks forward to welcoming you to a familiar family tradition soon. Starting September 25th, Explore days full of play and night and all aglow at Harvest Festival presented by Humana. Grape Cup Pumpkin Luminites presented by Coven and Health. With experiences around every corner, this season's Great Pumpkin Luminites glows bright. Pumpkin displays, unique treats, festive entertainment and so much more are waiting for you. Do not miss it. So that was just a small paragraph there, just to show you some first details. As we know, it's commencing at the end of September, September 25th. And, um, you know, I've, and like I said, I've seen videos and pictures and audio reels from, you know, past years of this event at Dollywood. And, you know, I think that this event is going to be one of the best themed events in any kind of theme park around the world, in my opinion. And I say that with pride, because... The, the Harvest Festival theming scattered around the park is magical. Um, I, I, mean, the, I mean, obviously Wildwood Grove, obviously that's going to be included in the event again for the second year. So, um, you know, we, we know that Wildwood Grove is going to get some beautiful uh, fairy tale magic Harvest Festival uh, theming around it. We know there's going to be several activities around the park, which I'm sure if they reveal more details on it, then we'll uh, give them to you guys uh, in more videos. And um, yeah, Dollywood definitely is going to try and push the boat here, I'm sure. I think with the code restrictions, obviously social distancing is important. However, I think that won't stop Dollywood for trying to do it in the safest way possible to push the boat out this year and try and expand their Harvest Festival offerings. So, um, I mean, we've got the, the custom pumpkin carvings. I'm sure that'll be a thing. Uh, I know there's some talented people coming in to do... So, I mean, I saw an imagery of pottery on the website, so maybe they're going to try and do some Harvest Festival pottery uh, somewhere in the park. So that'll be a lovely thing. I mean, I've uh, seen pictures of these guys in previous years that work with pottery, and they create some incredible creations. So, you know, if those guys come in again for this year, that'll be an incredible thing, obviously working under uh, coronavirus conditions. Um... So obviously, obviously, we'll, I think if they are going to come in, we'll see them wearing masks, we'll see the, uh, the gloves being worn and things like that. So I think it's just the usual code restrictions and sticking to them. But what I am very excited for is, you know, what other activities they're going to push. Is there any new stuff coming to uh, the Harvest Festival celebrations this year? Is there any new stuff coming? So 
I'd be really excited to see if there is going to be some new stuff coming to the event this year, and uh, if so, what are they going to be and how they're going to do it in a safe way. So, big props to Dollywood for going ahead with the event. Don't forget, it starts September 25th. If you want to book your tickets, just you know check out the Dollywood website. I've left the link to the uh, event in the description down below, and if tickets are on sale for it already, or if there's any tickets on sale for that date, then just go and book them. Just go and book them in the website link in the description down below. Uh, and again, big props to Dollywood for going ahead with this, and hopefully we do see some new stuff for the Harvard Festival in 2020. So there we go. That is talking about Dollywood's Harvard uh, uh, Harvest Festival uh, event for 2020. Uh, the Great Pumpkin Lighting by, by uh, the Luminites kind of thing. Again, really excited for that. I can't wait to see what they're going to do with that. And uh, for now, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe for more updates. Got plenty more updates where that came from. And for now, guys, my name is Coast Shell. Donks to born, but built for theme park news. Keep living the coastal life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an awesome day.